These are Japanese eggplants. Now, you're used to using European eggplants, which were the really big ones. They're also purple, but they're large. But remember this, you never have to peel an Asian eggplant. We are gonna semi-peel these today, just so it aids in grilling. We want this eggplant to turn from really firm into a nice kind of soft, but not too soft eggplant that has a lot of sugar that will really impart its flavors. So the way to do that is let's start our grill first, and I'm gonna set the grill to high. I always want my grills to preheat. And from there, I could grill these actually with the skin on, but the skins would actually get a little too tough. So what I'm gonna do is called an alternating peel. So watch what happens. I'm actually gonna take the peeler and then peel one strip, kind of turn it and then peel another strip. But in between, you're gonna leave one strip there. So this alternating peel will do a few things. It's gonna actually allow the eggplant to stay semi-firm, but still, you know, not let it, you know, fall apart too much. So I'm just alternating peel. Another thing, we've got a little bit of oil here. So I'm gonna oil these eggplants up right before we throw them on the grill. But as you can see, it's real simple technique to do. And I'm leaving the little caps on top. I don't really wanna cut them off. You don't really eat those, but they really lend to presentation as well. Now remember, you kinda eat with your eyes before you, know, you actually put the food in your mouth. So if the food looks fantastic, you know that your diner's gonna perceive it to taste even better than it already does. So using a little brush, I'm just gonna give these a rub down. Now really, don't be afraid here. Be pretty generous with the oil, because this is gonna be on the grill quite a while. And the oil is going to kind of help crisp up that outside of that skin, and it's going to start bringing the sugars out of the middle. So we hear a lot about caramelization, and all that really means is, you know, we'll cook down the eggplant, or we'll cook down anything you're cooking, and then uh, as it browns or as it cooks, the sugars really start to come out. So of oil there, and I'm waiting for the grill. And if you're not sure when to lay the eggplants on the grill, or actually when to lay anything on the grill, feel free to put a little dab of oil right onto the grill. And what's gonna happen is you're gonna start to see a little bit of white smoke happen. We're at about 350, 400 degrees. That's that smoke point of most high temperature oils. And again, this is canola oil or any vegetable oil. So I'll lay those on there and let those start grilling off. That nice, easy grill sound is what we're looking for. That means these things are on their way to caramelization. Now remember, this is like a medium paste grill, so let that sugar really come up on its own and we'll check back in a few minutes. I'm looking at a little bit of smoke here, so that means it's time to start checking. So what we'll do here is a quarter turn and then we'll start to see the grill marks. So I've got some color going on. Now what I'm gonna do now is actually lower the grill a little bit. I want these to really start slowing down. I don't want them to cook too fast. These are cooking up really nicely. All I'm looking for here is the eggplant to start to soften up a little bit. Now they look pretty roasted, but really this is just caramelization. This is gonna be really sweet on the palate. So that's looking good. Let me show you though how to tell when the eggplants are done. Real simple. I'm really gonna take the tongs and if you feel that they're soft, right, if you can kind of squeeze them and they give to some pressure, you're done and you're good to go. Now grilled eggplant, usually looks like it's a little charred on the outside, but if you think about what's happening on the inside is all that eggplant in the middle has been cooked soft and it's really nice and sweet. So I'm gonna show you how to plate these up. So I'll take two, I'll leave these two behind, and I can throw them on the plate whole, but to really kind of give you a better presentation, watch what I'll do. I'll take the knife and I'll just kind of make a cut down center and it's so soft and buttery, man, it's so nice. So I'm gonna open them up slightly, just spread them open a little bit, and I'll take the next one now. I'm gonna make a slit down the middle again, cutting all the way through so I can open them up and lay them down. And what, what we're trying to do here is we really wanna encourage the diner to look inside and see how sweet this eggplant really is. So with the eggplants open, I'm gonna take that miso sauce and really just kind of glaze it down here. Now eggplants are fantastic food. A lot of people you know, really are not fans of eggplants because I don't think they've had them cooked well. So when they try a really nice sweet eggplant, you can always appreciate eggplant when cooked correctly. So it's a little bit of sauce on there. And then for a little bit of garnish, I'm just gonna do a little bit of sesame seed for this one. 